Hello and welcome back to the channel. So for about the third time of trying to sort this video out today, I'm taking a third attempt at doing this video. So today we have a game called Color Grid. Now basically this game is a little puzzle game where you basically have a bunch of, of um, little things where you put the light on and the laser goes through the coloured square. So obviously they ease you in quite easy, well, with ease, and um, show you how to play the game. Now, I'd say the first 10 levels are pretty straightforward. They basically just turn the lights on. And that's basically all there is to it, to some extent. You turn some things around and press them on. Now it does get harder, like I say, I think I think I got to about level 50 something. Um and basically you're either turning them on or blending colours together to make the others. Now they do introduce some other bits and pieces later on like mirrors and such and other colours as well, all of some blockers like that thing where in the middle of the screen there's like a, a blocker which stops that yellow from going through so you have to put the yellow one at the bottom basically but all in all the gist of the game is that you're turning little lights on via the lasers to make the grid so here's a blending example where you've got to make purple and off you go Obviously, a lot of these are a lot easier at the beginning. I'd say yeah, the first 10 levels are quite straightforward. However, as you progress, they do get in particularly harder because you don't need to necessarily use all of the colours that are there or you don't necessarily need to use all of the spots to put the colours in to make the grid light up correctly. And therein lies how difficult it can get so obviously you're just making orange at the bottom there so that'll be the yellow and the red and the blue one to go through the other two but and there you go it's done obviously it does get harder like i say now this is the, the this game cost 99 cents didn't cost much at all um now sometimes like on this one you'll see it's kind of like symmetry top to left to bottom right as to how that works to get the colors correct but in, you know it depends on how your head works and how you work them out because at the end of the day you've got to try and turn these things on and figure out the puzzle and not everybody's mind works the same way and that's the beauty of puzzle games in general really but i think this game is worth the 99 cents every day of the week and it's it's so so relaxing and chilled and the background music's really good and for the cost you gain a hundred levels and <laughs> it is very good and i really like it now i know there's a lot of other switch games out there which are cheap and everything and it's difficult to work your way through the, the uh plethora of different ones out there actually find ones that are half decent so here here is one that actually is worth the money i believe so like i say there you go symmetry the form of symmetry there to get that working now Here's a very annoying and difficult one on level 13. I believe I uh, do do this quite quickly on here, mind, but I have played through a lot of the levels already, so I can kind of remember them. But now, obviously, like I say, the, the uh, it adds in mirrors as well in a minute, and like I was saying, when they add new things in, it take, they give you a couple of levels which are really, really straightforward and then chuck you a really hard one. And then everything just starts getting very hard. Like, 
there's one and it takes you like half an hour to figure it out and then you're like hmm okay that's enough for today i don't want to play anymore <laughs> and um yeah there you go but you um which for me gives you very good value for money if uh, one level is taking you half an hour then you know i mean you're trying to then do all of the other levels you're going to get a lot of value for your 99 pence or cents to do the levels and that for me is great because the portability aspect of the game is for the switch is absolutely perfect so here's a mirror look for you to go and do the uh, the mirror type level now the next one uh, level 15 was a lot harder um See, symmetry again okay. but anyway as i said i've had to re-record this video now twice so i'm hoping this one comes out a hell of a lot better um <laughs> i do like to thank somebody uh, who i talked to on twitter for letting me know that the video's uh been a, was a bit broken i don't know why i didn't realize myself so but if you do have any questions or anything about the game just drop them down below and i'll get back to you on the next one Thanks and goodbye.